Hello, fellow rock tumblers. Check this out. I found this rock down along the Rio Grande River near Terlingua, Texas recently. I was down there doing some rock hounding. Found lots of cool rocks, including this one. It's obviously some type of agate. I think it's a saginitic agate. You can see these sprays emanating from this little point here. And when I get it wet, it looks pretty interesting. You can tell it's translucent. It's a little small to do much with other than throw it in a tumbler and see how well will this thing tumble and polish. So let's do that. Let me get this rolling in a barrel, get it in a coarse grit, keep it rolling until it gets nice and smooth. Maybe not perfectly smooth because I don't want to make this thing so small it becomes useless. So there'll probably be some small pits left in it, but that's okay. I'll get it smooth enough so that it takes a great polish. Once it's that smooth, I'll bring it back in here and show you what it looks like before moving it onto those polishing stages. Check it out, the saginitic agate is finished with the coarse grit tumbling and it looks like it's going to be a stunner once it gets polished, don't you think? Check that out. Now, as I said before, I did not grind this thing perfectly smooth. I wasn't going to get out all of these pits. It would have made this thing too small. Now, let's take this thing and get it started in the vibratory tumbler. I'm gonna get it going in my regular eight day four step process. And then I'll bring it back in here and show you what it looks like. Hopefully it'll be nice and shiny. All right, rock fans, check it out. The saginitic agate from West Texas found out along the Rio Grande River is all finished. What do you think? Isn't this a beauty? Look at the shine it took and check out that pattern in there. I really like that. Wow. I just think that's so pretty. Like I said before, I didn't bother trying to tumble it perfectly smooth, knowing that it was just going to get really small. Instead, I left it like this, which I'm very glad I did because frankly, I like that contrast between the shiny smooth surface and those flaws. Wow, what do you think? What a beauty. So glad I found this. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please remember to check my other videos for a lot more like this. Thanks again.